welcome to medical dialogues your daily dose of health and medical news i'm roshni dhar let's look at today's top headlines not equivalent to mbbs in india and mc decision on course in philippines in a major setback for foreign medical education in the philippines national medical commission has refused to account for the two year bs course towards the required minimum duration of a foreign medical course to be considered equal to the domestic mbbs course In doing so, the Apex Medical Regulator and MC clarified that BS and MD course offered at Philippines medical colleges are two different things. And since the pattern of BS course being taught prior to the MD course is very much in line with the module of the class 11th and 12th in India, hence it may not be included in the required MD BS course duration for the countries where the duration is less than 54 months. Edit window for NEET PG 2022 opens today. National Board examinations in medical science will open the edit window for NEET PG 2022 applications. Candidates who have applied for the NEET PG graduate courses can make changes through the official site of NBEMS. The edit window will remain open from 29th March to 7th April. The final edit window to rectify deficient or incorrect images will open on 26th April and will remain open till 30th April. Candidates who want to make changes can do so. Using robotic surgery at AIMS Jodhpur doctors removed nine tumors. Using robotic surgery at AIMS Jodhpur doctors removed nine tumors from one kidney of a patient suffering from a rare inheritable disease called VHL caused by development of cyst in the kidneys, pancreas and genital tract. The procedure which lasted for 31 minutes is the first of its carried out at AIMS for kidney after some very complex robotic surgeries for many other diseases. Coffee drinking may cut heart disease risk prolong survival. Are you one of those whose morning is incomplete without a cup of coffee? A trio of analysis suggests that regular coffee drinking, especially a daily intake of 2 to 3 cups, is not only safe for the heart but may be cardioprotective. People with cardiovascular disease with that level of coffee intake compared with those who were not coffee drinkers showed significantly reduced risk of deaths and a range of CVD endpoints. The reductions ranging from 8% to 15% over about 10 years. In a separate analysis, participants with CVD at baseline who showed significantly improved survival with coffee intake of 2 to 3 cups daily, no increased risk of arrhythmia. Tata Capital Healthcare Fund raises rupees 955 crore fund. Tata Capital Healthcare Fund 2 sponsored by Tata Capital Limited has announced the final close of its fund with investor commitments of INR 955 crore meeting its target AUM of INR 950 crore. This was a follow up to the Tata Capital Healthcare Fund 1 which has raised 411 crore in 2012. That's all for today. Stay safe. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.